guys, welcome back. It's Emily and I'm giving you another shopping haul today. Um, I'm going to probably be doing a lot more of these because I love doing them. Um, I love shopping, I love trying them on, and I love showing them to you guys so that you guys can buy these items as well. Um, so today I'm going to be showing you items from Urban Outfitters, Zaffle and Fairy Season. Uh, Zaffle and Fairy Season are two um, Chinese based websites that sell really, really affordable clothing. Um, they can be somewhat on the cheap feeling side, but that's why I'm here to show you these items that I bought to tell you if it's worth buying or not. So I'm going to start with Urban Outfitters. And I just want to show you a few items that I got. So the first item I'm showing you are just these mom jeans. Um, they're really high rise and I really like these. I actually have another pair of these from American Apparel that look just like these pretty much except they're lighter. But I think this is a great style. I love how it rolls up on the bottom. Um, super stylish, super comfortable, and super in. How many times can I say super in, in one sentence? Um, but I got these in a 27. In my American Apparel ones, I got them smaller. And I don't know about you guys, but whenever I sit down, you know, your legs kind of go... Can you hear my cat? Um, but anyways, my legs kind of go just a little bit bigger, and I don't really like that. So I wanted to get these a little bit bigger than my usual size. So yes. These are super cute and I like them. So the next item I wanted to show you from Urban is this blue kind of like purplish romper. Um, it actually has leaf prints on it if you can tell. All the different uh, colors are leaves, which I really like. I thought that was a really nice little like detail. And then the back kind of goes and it connects and then it's a low cut um, so I usually don't wear a bra with this. Well, I've only worn it once, but um, I wore pasties, and that does just fine for me. Um, now, if you have bigger boobs, uh, like a strapless bra that has like clear straps in the back, I think it would be just fine. But I really like it because it kind of looks like a dress on the bottom. It's very flowy, super comfortable. This material is so nice. I really like this, and I got this in a extra small. Alright, so next item I wanted to show you was this uh, white t-shirt material type crop top. Um, it's super fitting right here and it has these seams, well, you probably can't see on camera, yes you can. The seams where your boobs are and then it goes into this, correct me if I am wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's called a bubble sleeve. So it like bubbles out and then uh, cinches at your wrist. And um, I thought this was super cute and super trendy. I'm getting ready to go to New York in a couple of weeks. And I thought this was very, like, uh, city style, I guess you could say. Um, but I really like the, the detailing on the, well, ooh, there's a piece of lint. <laughs> so I thought this was a super cute pickup. I got this in a size small. And I'm definitely going to be wearing this. Even though it is long sleeve, it's a crop top. So it kind of makes up for it, you know. So, yes, yeah, super cute find. Love this. Okay, on to Fairy Season, um, which is the Chinese website. It typically takes about two to three weeks to get most of the items in. Unfortunately, I did have one item that took about a month to get here, which is pretty upsetting. I contacted them and never really heard much back, but I did receive it, so I'm not going to complain anymore. Um, just kind of watch and most of the time it says when it will be shipped out within like one to three days or seven to twelve So keep your eye out for that. Um, it probably was just my mistake, but this is actually on my Instagram I will actually put a picture up right here. So um, I absolutely love this. It is a dupe of the Tommy Hilfiger Bando. Very vintage super super cheap. I got this in a size small and I think it was like ten dollars so i really like this i think it looks super nice um it is a bit see-through so i wear pasties whenever i wear this for sure um but i love this um super cheap super cute and really nobody's gonna be able to tell okay so next item this is the item that took forever to get in but it is a set if i can try to show you how this works here's the top and then it has these long like string tassel things and it ties in the front and you tie it in a bow and then the shorts are just like this and then on the back 
they have the elastic so they fit the only thing about this material is it is super see-through i know you won't be able to tell when you wear these i would be sure to definitely wear like, nude underwear and then with these i wear pasties or um, a strapless nude bra and then just kind of tie it to where it hides um, but this is really cute and it was like ten dollars i got this in a small and I absolutely love this. I think it's super cute how it ties in the front. I think it's a really nice accent. And for what you're paying, I mean, you kind of get what you pay for. So I still think this is super cute even though it's not the best uh, material in the world. I'm definitely still going to wear it. Okay, so next item. Um, kind of the save the worst for last. That's not the saying. It's usually save the best for last. But I save the worst for last so that you could see the best items first. Um, but I ordered this black bathing suit, and I'll put a picture on the screen of what it was supposed to look like, but I got these in the top. I'm getting ready to show you. Like, I can't even design it on camera. I'll have to take 20 minutes to figure it out whenever I do the try-on, but like, does this look like a top to you? Because to me, it just looks like a mess. And that's pretty much what this bathing suit was. I did order this in a uh, medium. It's okay if you want to take like a cute picture in it and whatnot, but it's definitely not realistic. When I move my arms, like I'm totally scared something's gonna come popping out. So I think this was definitely a no-go for me. So yeah, we're gonna just throw that over there. Moving on to Zapple, I have ordered a few items from this website already, so um, I can say pretty much that I think they are a good website to order from. Um, always look at the reviews on items because they do tend to run smaller on certain things, so always be aware of that. But I got these items in two weeks exactly, so I'm very pleased with them. I just got this cute pink bathing suit with these blue tropical looking flowers, and then um, it crosses in the back and it is full coverage it has a nice like plunge line so you're showing like a little bit of skin but I really like this I think it's super cute and I'm pretty sure it was like fourteen fifteen dollars um, I'll put that down in the description below as well as everything else that I've showed you already so look for those items and I'll also be linking them as well so you can shop them if you wish um, but yes I really like this and I think it's super cute also another bathing suit. Tropical print is really my thing during the summer so especially with my bathing suits because I like to be like summery but it is just this like blue gray bathing suit with these pink flowers again tropical um, but this is the front it has a V neckline it is really low cut on the side so you do have that side boob action it is definitely high rise and very cheeky um if you've been over in this you can almost guarantee that your butt is going to show got this in a small but it is a little bit tight on my bottom area and i don't think i have like a big butt or anything still i love the print i think it's super fun and festive for summertime so yes Okay, so the last item that I wanted to show you was this red dress. Super, super cute. I'm in love with it. I can't wait to wear it somewhere, but I'm waiting for, like, somewhere super awesome to wear. I got this at a boutique that is in my hometown. It's called Simply Be, so if you live where I live, go check it out. For those of you who do not live where I live, I linked two links down below that are dresses from Lulu's. I looked on like almost every boutique kind of dress website that I could to try to find the perfect dupe for this dress. I did my very best and I think I did a pretty good job honestly. So I put those two down below um, in the same price range. I paid like $50 for this dress. I kind of guess a little bit pricey but not really because I love it. But Anyway, so it just has these two straps that go right here, and then this ties around your neck, so it kind of sits like that, and it goes about halfway down. It is a super, super great material. I absolutely love this. It just goes like this in the back, and then it has this crisscross detail, which one of the dupes that I found had like the exact same crisscross design. So, super cute. Love the flowers. Very tropical. 
definitely have to wear this soon. So that's all I have for this video. Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please like this video and subscribe. And also turn on the little bell so you get notified whenever I upload. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.